welcome all uh, hope you are uh, engineering services examination preliminary 2021 preparation is almost over so upsc has released admit cards uh, now uh, all doubts uh, are closed ke postponement of this examination so many students were of uh, the idea ki that uh, due to ongoing covid situation the exam may be postponed but that has not happened so it will be conducted uh, on the scheduled date of 18th july okay so now uh, how to utilize this uh, 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 remaining uh, 20 25 days effectively so as to maximize the output uh, i'll try my level best to give some inputs to you uh, so that it may be useful uh, to improve your efficiency now if you see our previous statistics i'm talking about marks uh not uh, i'm i'm not talking about the question paper uh, uh, about the statistics of uh, number of questions from particular topic i'm not talking that i'll talk a little later but i'm talking from uh, statistics from max point of view if you see last year mechanical cut off uh, uh it was 262 out of 500 this was preliminary cut off so what does it mean each question uh, is for 2 marks we have actually non technical portion uh, we have for 200 marks and technical portion is for 300 marks here the number of uh, these are marks and number of questions are 100 for non technical and 150 for a uh, technical so overall it is 250 uh, to, uh, total 250 questions in preliminary and if you see uh, like uh, uh, this uh, each question is for 2 marks so it means 132 chalo if you attempt 132 if you have attempted say 131 i am sorry if you have attempted 131 correctly then you would have cleared uh, engineering services preliminary but please don't think that every time it will be 262 it may vary it may vary depending on the relative toughness depending on number of posts chalo theek hai on an average let us take 270 okay means you need to attempt 135 questions correctly so matlab jo previous statistics hum dekh rahe hain okay 135 questions correctly so out of 250 135 means around 60% 55 60% so please my dear students if you have means if your 60% answers are correct then you have a chance of clearing preliminary so some students might not have covered the syllabus 100% syllabus uh, they might not have covered and please do not worry if you have not covered 100% syllabus so 60% you should attempt matlab ye nahi bol raha ki you should attempt only 60% no so if that is whatever uh, you are attempting 60% of the questions if it is correct then you have a fair chance that's what i meant okay let us assume that you have covered 80% of the syllabus let us assume you have covered 80% of the syllabus means there is a chance for you to attempt more than 135 questions but whatever you have prepared if you have prepared sincerely and perfectly then this is applicable so now do not touch any new areas let us say you have not covered in non technical portion you have not covered ict imagine but now don't try to start from the beginning anyway if you have a rough idea if you have covered earlier yes you can go through it but now it is the time only for revision so if you uh, prepare for about 11 hours a day during these 20 25 days you split like this around 4 to 4 and a half hours for this and 6 and a half hours for this technical this should be your strategy and please do not focus only on technical do not focus only on non technical because every uh, paper has got its own limitation uh, the non technical portion can fetch you only 100 the uh, technical portion can give you only 300 but if you put these two you have more than these two so therefore you uh, 
uh, you dedicate your time judiciously for both non-technical and technical. Now, see, uh, out of 10 topics of non-technical, uh, if you have covered all the 10, it's well and good. But say now, with the assumption of postponement of COVID, uh, of this engineering services preliminary examination due to COVID situation, some people assumed that as a civil services examination uh, is being postponed. So on similar grounds, this will also be postponed, they thought. So around 30 to 40 percent of the students, they delayed their preparation. So they have not covered certain portions. So if you have not covered, now don't start now. It is very dangerous because if you are starting the new topic now, it will consume more time. So you will not have time left for the revision of whatever topics you have covered. That is the important point you need to note. Please do not waste your time in starting the new topic. Jobhi aap cover kiye, whatever you have covered, just consolidate, keep revising, keep revising, keep revising. Theory, PYQs, theory, PYQs, you can do that. If you have prepared short notes, it, it's, it is well and good and just revise those short notes. Then, uh, in technical also, uh, especially in mechanical engineering, so some students, they have not covered robotics, mechatronics, and uh, renewable sources of energy. If you have some idea, agar isse pahile kabhi padhe, so if you have studied this earlier, then you just can superficially. But if you have not at all touched this topic, this subject, don't start now. It will consume a lot of time. And there is no need for you to worry that you have not covered this portion. The problem with you is like, if you start thinking, I have not covered this, I have not covered this, I have not covered this. The problem is, whatever is there with you, you are forgetting. Are you try to utilize whatever you have covered. So try to maximize from that. Now the time has come to maximize to show your output. So whatever you have not covered, please don't worry. Whatever you, you have, you try to focus on that rather than what you have not covered or what you have not done. So, daily around 11 hours, split this into these parts and then uh, no new things to be covered. And one more thing, uh, you can take out of 100, uh, how many questions are there? 100 in uh, GS, 150 in technical. So, we have got 250 questions and you have one third negative. So, overall out of 250, you can take a risk of what do you mean by risk? There are some questions you, which uh, you feel that I have studied this somewhere, I have studied this somewhere, this must be the answer, this must be the answer. There are some questions of that sort. So you can take a risk of around 8 to 10 questions, not more than that. Not more than that. Yebhi, please, uh, sir said, uh, take risk of 10 questions. No, if all 10 are wrong, don't blame me. If you feel that this is almost, and if you are doubtful, ki ye, uh, see uh, something like this, uh, he gives 1, 2, 3, 4. Consider the following statements of this 1, 2 are correct, 1, 2, 3 are correct, something like that. So you may be sure of this, but not sure of this. But options A is given as 1, 2, B is given as 1, 2, 3, C is given as 1, 2, 4. Kindly don't take risk because you are not aware of this but at least 50 percent uh, if you are aware of any one of these three four then you can take risk so almost eight to ten questions ka risk le lena iska matlab kitna risk hoga if you take 10 uh, 10 questions let us say each is for two marks 20 marks so 20 marks ka one third is what around seven marks no problem we are playing a safe game but Please, one more thing, in assertion and reasoning part, you should be very careful. Generally, students lose in assertion and reasoning. So, if you are not sure of any of the statements, maybe assertion or reasoning, leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Don't take the risk. And one more thing, calculation part. Calculation part is very, very important. See, you try, see, let us say you have covered only 80% of syllabus. With this, also, it is possible. What is the reason for that? So, whatever you have covered in this, if you uh, give correct answers for this, from this, and then there is no problem at all. 
So no new areas must be covered now. Whatever you have covered, consolidate, revise. Then uh, please keep like uh, mentally you have to be very cool. So I have not covered this. I have not covered this. Whatever you have covered, think that abhi, abhi mental state is very important. Whatever you have covered, let us say you have covered some syllabus. Think that you have covered that completely. That's all. That is your 100%. And that you try to focus and give your best in that. So, it, it all depends on how you perform on that particular day. You might have worked so hard during these 7-8 months. But if you are not mentally strong, that self-confidence is very, very important. And please, one more thing is, let us say you have not solved some 5 questions continuously. Five questions continuously. One, two, three, four, five. And there is no need for you to worry. No problem at all. Mentally cool. In the middle, you may be seeing some lengthy questions. Skip those and go to the next questions. But finally, and see that last May, you should not uh, feel ki, I have not attempted this. I have not attempted this. I have not seen this question. No. You scan complete paper. You scan complete paper. There are some questions wherein just by looking at, you can give the answer. So once that is over, then you can come to your routine procedure of uh, solving those questions. There is no need for you to worry. Whatever you have covered, be confident in that. So try to uh, uh, consolidate those areas. That's all. Nothing more than that. So keep me mental state is very, very important. This mental state is very, very important, my dear students. You have to be very strong mentally. So proper mental balance and self-confidence is very important so and one more thing ki last year sir i found uh, from this area uh, less number of questions let us say uh, i'm talking about non-technical portion uh, this year uh, therefore i have not touched clearly it is mentioned uh, in the syllabus ki from each area 5 to 15 percent weightage will be given so means it may be uh, lowest possible is 5 maximum is 15 so, uh, there is no need for him to follow the same. He may he will be in that range. Uh, this time, who knows? Many questions may come from drawing. We don't know. Please, uh, don't think that, uh, sir, I have not covered drawing. You said drawing, you said both questions. I no, I am not saying that. See, uh, uh, you should not be of that intention. Ki, uh, last year, there were no questions from this area. So, this year, it will not be, uh, uh, the, you don't get questions from that area. That is also wrong. And please, uh, if uh, some of your students say, uh, like, uh, you have not covered this, you have not covered this, so chances are less, uh, the competition is so high. No, you go, give your best and come. So there is no need for you to worry. Mental balance is very important. Uh, see, An Academy has come up with some of the uh, beautiful test series, that is combat test series. And uh, this is a weekly test and, you know, uh, it is of one hour duration and these papers are set by uh, uh, the top educators themselves. And we have got some uh, new batches like uh, the, the uh, for first to third rank, uh, we have a subscription for one year. And then uh, for four to ten, we have got about 75 percent and uh, 11 to uh, 50, it is about 50 percent. Uh, the new batches that are uh, coming. And uh, we have Lux batch and Arohan batch for uh, gate and engineering services. Already we started and all the top educators will be taking uh, uh, these courses. And we have got one iconic batch wherein personal attention will be given to you. So please work hard. Don't worry about anything. Give your best. All the best. God bless you. Thank you.